Hello, everybody. Here comes everybody. I love it. Happy Saturday, everybody. And I'm so glad that so many of you are joining us today for another great singing day here in the Daily Antidote of Song. We uh, are blessed today to have with us Melissa James, who's coming in from London. We haven't had her in the room for a while. Super excited to sing with her again. And we'll get back to Melissa in just a sec. We're going to say hi to everybody out there on the live stream. Hello, live stream. Glad you joined us today. Thanks for being here. And uh, we're going to say hi to everybody in this room. So hello to Aaron coming in from the Bronx in New York. Uh, hello, of course, to Melissa in London. We'll get back to you in a sec. Hi, Melissa. Uh, hello to Pauline coming in from Newcastle, UK. Good to see you. Hi, Athena in Brooklyn, Delhi in Maryland. Hello to David and Elsie coming in from uh, West Oakland. Hello to uh, Becky in Vancouver, Trish in Victoria. Hello to Deborah in Kentucky. Hello to Caroline in DC, Dan in Virginia, Sheila in North Florida. Hello to Susan in Ohio. Hi, Cricket in Maryland. Hi, Kim, coming in from Vancouver, one of our song leaders. Hi to Ruth and Clive, coming in from Birmingham, UK. Glad to have you here today. Bob in Albany. Kat, coming in from Vermont. Curly Tops, coming in from Vermont. Hello to Nancy. Hello to Bob and a bear in Massachusetts. Uh, I think, did I get you, Martha, Marsha, and Deli? I think I got you guys. Curly Tops in Vermont. Nancy coming in from somewhere. Cat, I think I said cat. Uh, everybody's bouncing. Linda on Orcas Island. Nice to see you. Hi to Annette in California. Hello to Hoda in British Columbia. Kevin coming in from New Hampshire. Sarah in Texas. Susan in Seattle, Caroline in Boy Carolyn in Boise, Kathleen in Albuquerque. Oh, Carolyn is reminding me that today is day 1,469 fabulous days of singing. As you can see, that's consecutive, FYI, in case you're new to us. Um, as you can see, we are uh, really moving rapidly towards our 1,500th day of being together in this space. Amanda and Miles in Michigan, hello. Hi to Lola coming in from British Columbia, Storm in Mass. Kate coming in from Charlottesville, I haven't seen you in a while, glad you're here. Benet in Berkeley, California, Anne in Silver spring louise coming in from devon uk and some folks off video bronwyn uh, in victoria elizabeth california lynn in connecticut uh, the cow in washington state carol in connecticut hi mommy in new jersey and incoming right now is cliff coming in from vermont let's all take a deep breath okay Super excited to sing today uh, and super excited to have with us Melissa James. She is a singer songwriter out of the UK. She has two albums and a single to her name. We're going to learn a lot more uh, about her after she sings a first song with us. And Melissa, we are ready to learn that song whenever you are ready to teach it. Hi. Wow. Hi. Thank you so much. I have to take a breath for you after Thank all. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> really good. Let's all just breathe together. I'm really glad to be back here. Thank you so much for having me back, and it's great to see all your faces on screen. So, this first song that we're going to sing is one I've not yet recorded, but I would love to record, and I will do. Um, I will do for my next record. So, this is called Step by Step. This is a song that I wrote some while ago. And in fact, it was when I was in the process of making my first record that I woke up with the words for this song in my head, which essentially, as I look back now, I realize it was like a letter to myself, spurring me on, giving me courage. So for anybody who might feel that they need words of encouragement, inspiration, something to keep them going if you're facing um, a challenging or difficult situation, perhaps this is the song that will bring you though that message. Um, so it's called Step by Step. I think we're gonna have the words in the chat, are we? Or are they there already? I can't see the chat actually. Where's yep, all chat? good, we got them. There it is, okay. So it's too long a song, too wordy a song to teach you everything today. Um, so maybe I'll teach you a little section every time I come. Um, so what I'm gonna do is just teach you the chorus because that's nice and quick. And that's actually got the crux of the message to it. And we can all do that together quite easily. But um, maybe I'll, I might sing a section of the verse just to give you a flavor of how the song moves and how it takes shape and develops. So let me just do that actually initially now. Um, excuse me if I'm sniffing a little bit. It's the hottest day of the year here in the UK. Um, so getting a little bit pollinated and also I'm getting over the flu. <laughs> okay, so this is called Step by Step. Step by step, day by day, you lose no 
your mind and you pave your way. Climbing mountains takes time. Hear these words I say. Just take it step by step and day by day. Mm -mm. When you've got a job to do, keep your sights set high. Ain't nothing stopping you reaching past the sky. The only limit is here in your mind. So just take a little step forward a day at a time. Don't you know that nothing is gained without struggle and strife? No. So be grateful for moments that bring joy to your life. Yeah. When you wake in the morning, give thanks for your days and make a promise to yourself not to let your dreams pass away and take it step by step, day by day. So that's where we are. The chorus continues. So rather than me carrying on with the song, why don't I just teach you that chorus right now? So the first line, step by step, day by day let me do it again step by step day by day sing it with me step by step day by day step by step day by day once more step by step day by day great have we got that Remember, always give me either a wave to say, yeah, I'm happy or a slightly shaky hand if you're not so sure. And we can keep doing it. That's fine. Are we, do I have lots of waves? Are we OK with that bit? OK, so the next section, you lose no mind and you pave your way. You lose no mind and you pave your way. You lose no mind and you pave your way. And again, you lose no mind and you pave your way. Are we okay with that bit? So what we have so far then is step by step, day by day. You lose no mind and you pave your way. Let's do that. Step by step. Day by day, you lose no mind and you pave your way. And again, step by step, day by day, you lose no mind and you pave your way. Are we okay with that? Anybody, anybody unsure so far? No, I think I'm seeing lots of I, yeah, great. I'm seeing some thumbs up. Wonderful. I am flicking between pages as well, just to check. Okay, so the next section then. Climbing mountains takes time. Hear these words I say. Climbing mountains takes time. Hear these words I say. Climbing mountains takes time. Hear these words I say. Climbing mountain sticks down, hear these words I say. Are we okay with that? Okay, we've got some hands in the air, some thumbs up, we've got some shaky fists, great. And so the last section of the chorus, um, just, just take it step by step and day by day, just take it step by step and day by day just take it step by step and day by day just take it step by step and day by day are we okay with that all of that do you think we can maybe try it from the top yeah let's give it a go i always say you know it doesn't matter if we make a mistake the singing police are not coming to arrest us we're just gonna sing and have fun, that's all, okay? And if we make a mistake, that's fine, we just carry on, okay? So, two, three, and step by step, day by day, you lose no mind and you pave your way, climbing 
Climbing mountains takes time. Hear these words I say. Just take it step by step. And day by day. And again, step by step. Day by day. You lose no mind and you pave your way. Climbing mountains takes time. Hear these words I say. Just take it step by step and day by day. Oh, wonderful. So I, I might just sing you the second verse. When we come out of, when I come out of the second verse, then we go back into step by step, okay? So let me get on with that. Two, three, mm. Don't pass no judgment with another man's shoes. Until you've seen the path he walks and the work he's got to do. Free yourself from past mistakes, forgive and let go. And don't forget to start each day with your wisdom and joy. Because that behind every dream, there is joy and pain, yeah. So learn to get up when you're kicked and start again, yeah. And don't pay no mind to the words that others will say. Just keep on keeping on. Smile along the way. Chorus and take it step by step. Day by day. You lose no mind and you pave your way. Climbing mountains takes time. Hear these words I say. Just take it step by step, yeah, and day by day, once more, step by step, and day by day, you lose no mind and you pave your way, climbing mountains takes time, hear these words I say, just take it step by step, yeah. Day by day, just take it step by step, yeah. Day by day, and again, take it step by step, yeah. Day by day, and again, take it step by step, yeah. Day by day, once more, step by step, and day by day. Oh, I'd love to teach you the whole song. <laughs> oh, Melissa James, that was a lot of fun to sing. Thank you so much. You're a powerhouse of energy and just radiant light. And uh, that was a really, really fun. Yeah, thank you. Um, thank you. Thank you. That is my song of empowerment. Yeah, it just picks me up again when I need a reminder that that's what I got to do. Thank you. So the next song we're going to do... Um, is my song for for peace it's and you know and i think we might all agree that we could do with a, a lot more peace in the world in our hearts because if the peace is in our hearts then it's certainly going to be in the world um so when i am at a point of feeling in despair and feeling hopeless and feeling like what can i do to help what's going on out in the world and feeling that after i've asked myself that question I don't have an answer there. I feel like helpless um, or, or feel like there's little that I can do. Uh, I'm reminded that actually in helping myself to instill peace within my own heart, that is my way of putting that peace back into the world. And when I go out into the world with that peace in my heart, I'm more likely to engage with others in a peaceful way so I'm also helping to maybe put some peace in the heart of somebody else as well. And if they receive that peace because they felt joyous on account of our encounter or maybe an encounter with somebody else who's made them feel good, then that little bit of peace and joy in their heart might be what they then pass on to others. And it is like, it's that simple. I mean, it's that simple and it's also not that simple, but 
you know i just that's the place i come back to again and again and and just to almost exemplify that yesterday as a really short um just a really short illustration i met a man on the street who was next to a station that i was walking into he was homeless and i offered him i offered to get him some food and he said to me, um, you know, I'd, he was saying a number of things and I couldn't quite understand what he was saying, but essentially I understood that he was saying that, you know, he didn't want food. Actually, the thing that he really wanted right now was a pack of cigarettes. I'm not a smoker. I know nothing about how to get cigarettes or what they are, but I went and got him a pack of cigarettes and I came back and I gave it to him and he had the hugest smile on his face. He said, that this has been a good day. This has been such a good day. Thank you for giving me these cigarettes. And I don't even think I needed to give him those, you know, he just, he was just the interaction almost was such a huge thing. So whenever, if, if you might be in a state of feeling hopeless and helpless, if we can try to do something that brings peace into our hearts, then we can maybe bring peace to somebody else. And that is, you know, it goes both ways. I felt so joyous just from seeing his joy. It was amazing. So the next song that we're going to do, moving on from that, is um is a song that i wrote at a time when i was i was calling for peace i was i'm part of plum village which if you don't know it is a, a buddhist group started by the peace activist um Thich Nhat han he moved to france having been exiled from vietnam where there was war and he set up plum village and plum village is now a glo global peace peace buddhist organization and during lockdown i became more connected to plum village and I was reading the words of Thich Nhat Hanh and one of the things that he advocated, he's now passed, but one of the things he advocated was walking meditation as a way to just bring peace to your heart, you know, noticing as you're walking your feet, your hoof, your, your toes landing on the ground and noticing how we can create less suffering if we walk calmly and think about how we're walking. We create less suffering in our own hearts and less suffering to those other beings and those things that we might be walking upon. And so he, he talked about walk as if you are way, walk in a way that you are kissing the earth with your feet. And that inspired me, this line just became a line in the song. And he, he would also say, it is my conviction that peace is the way. And that line inspired me. And those two lines became the song essentially. So we're going to sing, I'm going to teach you now to sing the song, which is called Kissing the Earth with Your Feet. So let me just, it's really super simple, and I'm sure just from me singing it, you can pick it up pretty easily. But we can go through it just to, just to make sure that we've all got it. Whoa. In a way, way that you are kissing the earth with your feet, we can walk in a way that we only print on earth serenity and peace Ooh, the way it is my conviction that peace is the way So maybe you can sing that chorus with me. Ooh, the way it is my conviction that peace is the way. So the ooze again. that 
peace is the way. Can we try that again? Ooh, the way. So the verse now, I'll teach you the verse, which is more or less the same, but we'll go line at a time. Walk in a way. So let's do that together. Walk in a way. And again. In a way, the next line that you are kissing the earth with your feet. Let me do that again. That you are kissing the earth with your feet. And again, that you are kissing the earth with your feet. We can walk in a way. We can walk in a way. Let's try again. We can walk in a way. Once more, we can walk. In a way, lovely, that we only print on earth serenity and peace. I'll do that again. That we only print on earth serenity and peace. Try with me. That we only print on earth serenity and peace and again that we only print on earth serenity and peace can we try the whole verse maybe if you're unsure at any point just stop and have a listen and then join when you can okay so walk in a way That you are kissing the earth with your feet. We can walk in a way that we only print on earth serenity and peace. Chorus. The way it is my conviction that peace is the way. Ooh, the way it is my conviction that peace is the way. Again, ooh, the way it is my conviction that peace is the way. Close your eyes if you want to. Peace is the way. Really feel that peace. 
peace is the way peace is the way peace is the way peace is the way Melissa James, everybody. Good grief, Melissa. That was really empowering and powerful. Uh, the whole thing, like you started out with empowerment and you took us into peace and they're so all interrelated. Uh, everything being about our impact in a way on the world and what we leave behind us and create uh, space for around us. And uh, yeah, can we all please um, give it up for Melissa again? Um, so Melissa, um, be, before we close with one cho chorus or verse, whichever one you feel like repeating a couple times, um, do you want to say anything more about sort of, you know, what brought those songs to you or how you're feeling in the world in general right now, or what you've got going on or all of the above? <laughs> um, okay. So, I mean, it, it's funny, you know, I don't plan, I, I don't sort of sit and try to spend a day writing. I kind of mostly, sometimes I do a little bit more work, but most of the time songs come to me and I might not realize it at the time, but later on looking back, I can see how that song that I wrote at that time was giving me what I needed to learn at that time. And when I, was writing that song kissing the earth with your feet i was you know i mean we were all i suppose most of us in some way or another 2020 21 21 in a state of flux and uncertainty and it was then that my practice that i'd been doing every day of meditating and those you know daily practices of walking spending time with nature i'm always with trees um meditating that's when i had to call upon those tools that i'd put in my toolbox that i was just having fun with on a daily basis and suddenly i've frozen can you still hear me we can absolutely hear you but your video is definitely frozen That's you frozen. might want to just yeah. try turning it off and turning it back on see if we get you back again but i'll tell you what just listening to you and not looking kind of like right in the theme of like the closing your eyes and the peace so um yeah. yeah. Okay. Try and turn it off and see if it comes back on, maybe. I will. There you are. Lovely. There we are. Okay. Little trick I didn't know. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I just see looking back, I, I see how that song was speaking to me about, you know, just it's funny, you know, when we're building up tools, when we're doing all the practices, it's only when we're in the heat that we realize that, oh, I do have some resources, I do have something that I can call upon, um, that this practice of doing yoga and walking and meditating is not just a nice exercise, there is a purpose to it. And it really did, and always has, continue to get me through those times when I don't feel like I have anything else and I'm flailing. Um, and as I sing it now, and it's really strange, I did a performance, um, a concert just a, a few weeks ago, and I sang that song at the end. And it's the simplest song. I was almost embarrassed when I wrote it because I was like, it's got two chords, you know, a few simple lines, but powerful lines from a powerful piece leader. Um, and somebody said to me, have you recorded that? You need to record, it's such a, like you could feel the air in the room just still. And then the audience started to sing it with me. So sometimes it's the simplest things that actually, because there's no complex, complexity around it, it makes it so much easier for all of us to just feel it right here. And, and for that message to vibrate within us and to vibrate around us, because I could feel the energy just shifted in the room. It was so powerful, so, I mean, so palpable, so real. 
Um, so I always sing it now and I always teach it to people and I feel so grateful that that song came to me somehow. Um, so yeah, I just, um, I, I feel blessed to be able to sing and to be able to write songs like that. And then to be able to be in a space here where I can share it to you and long may it continue because I just love being able to do what I do. <laughs> I Beautiful. really do. Melissa, yeah. thank you so much. I would say actually like it was the simplicity for sure that like, you know, let you like sort of get into it in another way. And then when you asked us to close our eyes, it was like you took away yet still one other complexity that we're involved in all the time that we don't even think about. And it was so when you were speaking with your video frozen, it was kind of like all just part of the thing like, oh, yeah, all we're doing right now really is we're feeling and we're listening and uh, and yeah, super amazing. Um, so do you want to pick one or the other to, um, to do a few choruses of before we close today, whichever okay. one. You yeah. Um, should we do more of kissing the earth? Cause I just I think that sounds great. I think the chorus to that is just, yeah, that's the message, right? So just yeah. the, the, ooh. so let me remind you. Ooh, the way. It is my conviction that peace is the way. Ooh, the way. It is my conviction that peace is the way. 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 Once more. Peace is the way. Peace is the way. Peace is the way. Peace is the way. <coughs> Melissa James, I think you started today by taking a breath for me. And I feel like that is also very symbolic of what you just brought to all of us. I feel like to some very deep way, we are all breathing for and with each other in a really special way. So thank you endlessly for bringing both of those songs. I think exactly what we all needed to hear in crazy times and in times of a lot of grief and uh, disharmony. So can we all please give it up another time for Melissa James? Um, Melissa. You. Don't know how long it was since you were last with us, but it was definitely way too long. So here's hoping we can reconnect sooner this time um, and have you back in here again soon. Oh, um, I do. And thank you so much for this space. I mean, I'm sure everybody here would say how, how they can express huge thanks for having a space like this. It's such a wonderful thing to be able to connect continually in this way and through song so thank you to you for joining as well i'm really glad to be able to, i was so excited when i got joe's email it's like, oh yes i get to do it again <laughs> yeah, wonderful just wonderful and you know i i would just say that you know and i i truly believe it like the peace ripples out into like we're here creating it now but in this space but it ripples outwards and somewhere somehow somebody is maybe feeling the feeling the impact of that and it, it's not to be knocked i'm part of a meditation group on a sunday um so it's seven o'clock 
in the evening UK time, whatever time that would be, <laughs> wherever you might be in the world. But, um, and I didn't start it. There's a woman who started it here in the UK. There's no Zoom or anything. She just says, wherever you are in the world, if you want to join me at the equivalent of seven o'clock in the evening, UK time, and we all just sit for 15 minutes together, just meditating for peace. And she's had people reporting back to her feelings that they've, you know, things that they've either seen in their mind's eye or feelings that they've had during the meditation. And they have been similar to what some of the other people have written to her. Like lots of people have said they've been experiencing the same thing. I've only just started joining it. But, you know, I think that is testament to the power of the intention of wanting to bring peace and the power of people all intending to bring that peace together and sitting down together. So yeah, let's not forget that. It's huge, it really is. Beautiful, Melissa, thank you. Yeah, if you think about it, just in terms of how many people you're singing with here and the folks that are out there on the live stream also, and then each of us takes this piece that we've just um, shared in here and touches another one or two or three or however many people we managed to touch today and how that multiplies so quickly and uh, and how we are in fact, so connected that we are in sometimes experiencing the same degrees or relationships of you know peace and thoughts and um can you tell us the name of that is that like an open thing online absolutely i was about to say so her name is pam gregory um pam gregory she's an astrologer she's brilliant she does lots of video updates on youtube on facebook where she shares her her monthly updates on all sorts of you know on what's going on in the astrological world um but every sunday at seven o'clock uk time so just find your equivalent time um for 15 minutes every sunday without any zoom links or anything we just all know that for 15 minutes at that time we can meditate and connect with that energy and it's just yeah a really beautiful thing to be able to do so that's pam gregory Thank you. So we've got the link in the chat there, folks, for her YouTube channel, and uh, you can check it out. And uh, hope some of you will join Melissa and her and whoever else in this room ends up doing it. Um, it does sound like a really necessary thing in the midst oh, of everything. So yep. completely, complete. If that's all we have to hold on to, that's a powerful thing to hold on to. You yeah, know, our peace is is our peace. P e a c e is our peace. Our p i e c e in the world, you know, and that's a big piece. So beautiful. Peace, everybody in this room. Let's let's one more time uh, shake hands for Melissa James coming in from London and uh, joining us uh, and bringing just so much light in and life to the room today. So thank you, Melissa. Um, we'll go ahead and uh, wave you out so you can get back to making albums and being busy. Really great to have you with us today. Thanks again thank for being here. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I have loved being here again. Thank you all of you for joining. Go well and go in peace. Thank you, Melissa. Take care. We look forward to seeing you again. We're going to say goodbye to everybody out there on the live stream. Thanks, gang, for joining us. Glad you were here today. Let's say goodbye to all the folks in the room. So Ruth and Clive in Birmingham, UK, thanks for being here today. Glad to have experienced this with uh, you and all of the folks in this room from all our different locations. Athena in Brooklyn, thanks so much for being here. Uh, it was really beautiful to watch everybody's face singing at the part when I didn't close my eyes. Um, it was really amazing. There was a lot of emotion in the room. David and Elsie, thanks so much for being here from Oakland. Glad to see your smiling, beautiful faces. Caroline in DC, thank you so much. I could really feel your energy, it was lovely. Sheila in North Florida, thank you. Susan in Cincinnati, thank you so much. It's great to see you. Cricket in Maryland, nice to see your beautiful smile. Hello, Bob, thank you so much. Well, be goodbye, Bob. Thank you so much for being here. Uh, my phone is ringing. Um, Linda on Orcas Island, thank you so much. Annette in California, who is holding up. I'm gonna move you out of my cheers to Ruth. Wait, do we have a birthday in the room right now? Yes, we do, I remember that. Hang tight, everybody, or maybe we had one yesterday. Uh, hang tight. Sarah in Texas, thank you so much. Did I say Aaron? Thank you for running text, uh, tech from Bronx, New York. Did I say Linda Norcas Island? Now I'm all confused. Susan in Seattle, Carolyn in Boise. 
Louise and Devin UK, nice to have you with us again today. Kathleen in Albuquerque, uh, lots of peace in your square. Jamie uh, in Victoria, Pauline and William in Newcastle UK, very beautiful. I can't wait to see what you're holding. Kevin Ennis, reminding us that it's day 1,469. Thank you so much, Kevin. Cl Lynn and Cliff in Vermont, thank you for being here with us today. Dally in Maryland, Martha in Oregon, Storm in Massachusetts, Becky in Van... Coover, screen number two, Bob, and a bear in Massachusetts, Bob and two bears, three bears, we have a birthday bear, uh, Benet in Berkeley, California, Trish in Victoria, Lynn in Connecticut, Anne in Silver Spring, Curly Tops, Cat in Vermont, Elizabeth in California, Nancy in Washington State, Cliff and Lynn in Vermont, Aloysius in Mass, and Amanda and Miles in Michigan. Thanks everybody so much. Let's give another big wave to the live stream. See you gang tomorrow. Lots of love.